first, you're fine. So I, uh, later I can give you some test code and we'll pass all the unit tests in your machine. And now we have some, uh, you can query your SQL table to see if the volume changes. And all the things you need to know about the chef, almost all the most used things is how to open the object with OpenID. So if you really, for example, open the object, um, you will have less code in your exercises than them. So there will be just some words about open, set the object, create the test object. So you will need to remember this code and exercises will contain less and less code. Is it clear? Okay. So this is the basic how to open some existing object. You should know how to get the ID of existing objects. So you go to SQL, for example, you query the table and see all the IDs. Uh, you can create the new object by using the new method. And then by setting some variables, you can save this object to the database and save it here. So that's the basics. We get some object from the database, we put it there and we save. Or we create a new object using a new method, then put some uh, values there, and then save this object to the uh, database. Uh, and there is some syntax how to uh, call the methods. APM update, for example, calls the method update and updates APM. This preserved by our logic, by that that is just written in our studio. Um, we call some methods and then again save the object and it goes to the hard drive. So that's pretty much all you need. You need to take some objects, you need to put some objects, that call the data transformation. So if you need to uh, change something, you open objects, do the transformation and save the object. That's the logic. Yeah. And now we'll work.